So I've always been curious about this. I say if you put some, a bolt and some water with some baking soda, you hook it up to a battery, right? And you let it sit in there, it'll anodize it. All right, so for my ground, I just took a little piece of sheet metal, welded it. I'm gonna, I, I just ended this to the wire. This little piece, I'm gonna push it on here to the negative. It says put the negative in here. Okay. I'm gonna do the same thing with my positive. I'm gonna run a wire uh, to this bolt. So now they say add distilled water. Uh, I'm guessing no minerals, but I don't happen to have any. I do have some baking soda. So I'm adding some baking soda. Don't really know how much to add. I feel like that's plenty. But then I have filtered water, which don't get me wrong, still has a ton of minerals in it. So I'm gonna pour that in there. So that looks like quite a bit of baking soda. Almost maybe. Is it too much? Let's stir it around in here. If anything, we could wash our whites. Get them a little cleaner. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm gonna take this thing, stick this in there. And then I have my nut and here's the power. I guess I'll stick this on here. This thing's a little tight, but whatever. And let's see. So it's definitely bubbling like crazy. Wow, that's pretty cool. Let's see if I can get you guys a better vantage point here. Wow, I have no idea how long you do this for. Uh, they say the amount, the volts and stuff are what change it, the different colors, but it's definitely going at it. Wow. Let's see, give it a few more seconds, see if we got anything. Hmm. Uh, I could see it kind of getting there. Let's keep it going. So I'm just going to do this. All right, so I've had this in here for several minutes now. Um, I don't know if I should leave it in longer or I'm wondering if I add multiple of these batteries. Uh, I have stronger ones, if that would make a difference. But um, let's take it out and wipe it down and just see how it looks compared to the original bolt here. I just hold it in my hands, but you could see it's a little darker, right? I don't really have a bluish color. I don't really see blue too, too much, but that could be because of the amount of electricity. All right, so I've taken two batteries now, hooked them up to this bolt, both grounds connecting in. I'm going to, I think I'm going to stir the baking powder or baking soda, I mean, a little bit here. Baking powder. Looks like a lot of it settled to the bottom. I don't know if that makes a big difference, but we're going to find out. Then we take this bad boy. Just zoom back here. Uh, dip her in here. Whew. Definitely getting some reactions now. Um, I was still getting them before, don't get me wrong. Okay, so, as you see, right there, let's give it a few minutes. Alright, so it's been in here for about five minutes. I'm gonna take it out. Let's 
bring it over here. All right, and let's look. Okay, so definitely a change for sure. Let me just take the brightness down. I don't know if you can see it, but the left one is the original one, right? And the right one is the anodized one. So it does make it a little bit darker. Um, I kind of like the look of that. Looks a little bit more industrious, but I didn't get any magical colors from it. So uh, if there's something, uh, if there's a trick or something or a way to get different colors and you know how to do it, please feel free to let me know.